Hi, this is Soft Cell Video Productions, and I'm your host, John. In this video, we're going to look at the NEC code on EMT bending. EMT is a lightweight metal pipe that is used to run various types of wire in exposed and outside areas, as well as in accessible areas. Let's look at the code. There shall not be more than four quarter bends, or the equivalent, between pull points. The key phrase is, or the equivalent. The reality is that you can have any combination of bins in between pull points as long as they do not exceed 360 degrees. Looking at this diagram, you see a 45 degree offset followed by three quarter bins for a total of 360 degrees of bins. This is within code. In the next diagram, we have a series of bins that would appear to be within code. But when you do the math, you see that your bins come to 405 degrees. Everything was fine with this conduit until the offset was put in at the end. And then we tip the scale over the 360 degree point. We came up with a total of 405 degrees. That's a no-no. This last diagram is really a suggestion and is well within code. I strongly recommend that you never go over 270 degrees of combined bins. If you're a seasoned electrician, you know exactly what I'm talking about. If you're new to the trade and try to stretch your bins to the 360 degree rule, then you're going to find out the hard way just why this code was written. On short runs, it's not that big of a deal, but on a long run, say 200 feet, that last 90 degree angle might be the one that your fish tape just won't get past. So trust me on this one. Put in another J box or pull box when you have a long run or are pulling close to your wire fill limit. I think that just about covers everything. So thanks for watching and have a great day.